Hello everybody, my name is Burgul. Welcome back to Subnautica. So, in the last episode, uh, my Seamoth couldn't go that deep, so I spent some time off-camera farming, and I managed to build a scanner room, which is over there, and I renamed the Seamoth. Yes, I did. The Dope Moth was meh. I named it the Dope Boat because I like Dope Boat better. And I upgraded it with a new module, with two modules, which are which are the MK3. I think that's the deepest it can go. It can go up to 900 meters. Actually, I was wrong in the other episode. I think the uh, Cyclops can go deeper than 900 meters. I think I was just thinking about the Seamoth. And hull reinforcement, which is great. And I farmed up some stalker tooths, teeth, for the scanner room. Let's go take a look at that real quick. Bulkhead door. Yeah, I need to get some stuff for that. I thought I built something over there, I guess not. The scanner room. Looks pretty cool. I don't know what that's for. Oh, cool. Kill. <laughs> Kill. Dude. Oh, dude. What? I need that. I, I totally need that. But this is cool because it shows you your little area. Obviously those two bloops are on each side of this room. I'm like right on the edge of this plateau, I guess. Yeah, so that's pretty cool. And I guess you can stream data with that upgrade on what you want. That's handy. I'm not gonna lie, that is handy as fuck. All right, cool. And I built some windows and did some stuff and my base is looking sexy as fuck. There is still an overabundance of uh, fish around my base. Actually, they cleared out. A lot of them did, which is good. <laughs> God, that was annoying. You just like, get outside the door and then you'd run into five fish consecutively all at once I guess not consecutively just all at once so now this thing can go to 900 meters which is amazing we're gonna go explore and do some stuff and I forgot to set the clock in the recording again was it been like two minutes three minutes I don't know. Probably just coming up on four. I have no idea. I have no internal clock. I'm just oblivious to everything. Where am I going? Actually... exactly where I'm going so over there is towards the heat signature where the cavern is there's an entrance around here somewhere I can't I come out of it and I never find it again and it's it's like in that direction I know that because I came up on my base on this angle but if you go straight this way from my base I think I got really, really lucky with the with the placement of of that of my home because <laughs> straight this way, there's a hole right there, right here that goes down to the heat source, and I know that because of that thing. Well, hello, how you doing? And if you go straight this way. South, right? South. Oh yeah, and I got a compass too. That's really handy. Helps my bearing. 
do, 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 do. down here. This thing goes really deep, freakishly deep, but it runs around to that other area where those little glowing blue balls are and where you get the fragments for something I can't remember. But the quartz down here is unbelievable. It's ridiculous. And uranium, apparently, too. I have a locker full of uranium for no reason. Whoa, frame rate dipped right there. That's weird. Do, 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 do. Caves. <laughs> I'm not really sure what these materials are used for. Hello. Okay then. But there's some sort of oily substance that is probably used for some lubrication in something, in somewhere, somehow. Oh, I'm underneath that thing. Okay, cool. I'm in the right area. And we can just keep going down. So I think the other upgrade was only able to take me this deep. But I got the MK3 now. So I should be able to go a lot deeper. Hello. I'm not scared of you. You're more fascinating than you are scary. Oh, hello. Jesus. Get away. <laughs> Leave me alone. Holy crap! That thing hurt me a lot, actually. Okay, it's scary. I lied. I lied. That thing is freaky. Where am I? Alright. So that's a thing. I saw somewhere that there was something like a rifle. I might need to look into that. A pulse rifle maybe or something? I have no idea. It wouldn't surprise me with the kind of technology that I have for having nothing. I wish this technology existed though. It's really cool. Alright, let's go... Okay, I'm going... Uh, let's go this way. I haven't gone over here. I want to know what's over here. Yay, I can't see anything. I'm just assuming that leads back down into that hole. And I don't want to go down there. Again. The fuck are you? Mosquito thing. What the hell? What are you? Can I scan you? Sea treader. What are you doing, sea treader? Okay. It is rather hard to see down here.
Have I reached the edge of the map yet? Is this it? Is this the edge of the map? I think so. Why is the edge of the map there, though? Yeah, that's the edge of the map. Okay, cool. Oh, stop. Obey me. Okay. Well, that's rather close to my base, actually. Mouse, goddamn. What the fuck is going on? Alright. That's getting annoying. There we go. Hmm, interesting. I'm gonna skirt along around here and see what there is to see. Doesn't seem like much. What are you? Oh, jeez! Hello! Alright, you can fuck right off now. Along with my mouse, because I can't... Well, then, Mr. Leviathan. Giving me a heart attack and all. all right, is this another edge of the map? I have reached a corner. Lots of planes or sand and shit. Just leading off into nothing. Another one. There's another one. I don't like them. They're scary. Wonder how many knife hits they take to die. And that's why I'm thinking about like the rifle. They had a rifle in the game? I think they do. I'm not sure. I saw the pulse cannon thing. I don't even know how to make that. I haven't made one. Don't know what kind of use that that's for, but anyways. Or what that'd be used for. Um, I'm still relatively new for this game. I just, you know, acquired a lot of stuff and... Oh, that's that way. Okay, cool. Right on. I think I'm going to take a trek around the Aurora next. I'm going to wear the radiation suit and go and see if I can't fix that stuff. And yeah. I think I have to go to the life pod and see if there are any messages. And that heat signature from the previous episode is from another crash from another ship, apparently. Which is kind of cool, actually. I, you know. It's old and it's all broken. Why the fuck they made it way the hell down there? I have no idea. They're morons. Oh well. can only assume that they're dead. And I found the island. The island is pretty cool. Okay, I'm going to...
just weld this up real quick. And then I'm gonna park it. Welcome aboard, Captain. Let it charge a little bit. Welcome aboard, Captain. I still have lots of time. I don't know what there is to do. I'm gonna hydrate myself and pick up a water bottle. And wow, I'm getting low on those. I'm actually going to put this on now. I don't see myself going very deep anytime soon. Doo -doo -doo. I think I can make a locker on the Seamoth and then just keep the rebreather and everything on that. That way I don't... I, I, when I need it, I have it, because most of the time I take that thing out to deep spots, so I just, yeah. That makes complete sense. I might do that. I'm also going to look into, what was that thing that I was going to, oh yeah, the scanner room. I'm going to go and grind up and get all that stuff next. What else am I doing here? Okay, that's good on battery. Separates water and salt. Do I need to put anything in here? Does it take water from outside? I think it does. It should. Oh, so it stocks up on four and then I can take them. Maybe. That's so cool! Yeah! That is super handy. Haha. <laughs> awesome. What else is there? Nothing really new. Might build more of these. Nuclear reactor. I don't know if I want to build that. I mean, it's definitely... better for some things that, that way I can use up all my uranium that I have and I can stop killing the environment with that huh cuz I'm not around many of those uh, those things we saw out on the tree the big long things with the I don't know what the fuck they're called I should probably scan it anyways they uh, manure and you can put the manure in the bioreactor and that'll transfer into a lot of energy I think I want to build that I don't know where I'm gonna build that though might up yeah up here you know what? I'm gonna do that right now because that is convenient whoa <laughs> that animation. Love it. What else can we build? I'm just going to grab a whole bunch of titanium. So I'm probably going to need it. Wow. That is awesome. What else can I build? Bench, picture frame. I need a window. So, glass, two. Two glass. I'm going to build a window up here. Um, so I have the machine. Yep. 
yeah. Uh, yeah. Sorry. I'm looking at where I should put the windows on the top levels of this tower thing. Tower thing. I'm just gonna re keep recording because I like decorating. That's that's one of my things. In all the games that I ever play, I love decorating. Yay! I'll build one there. Build one there. Cool. Alright. Um. Yeah. <laughs> Yay. I can build an aquarium up here. Somewhere. Fucking lawnmower. And the bench. Can't rotate it? Really? So the bench helps pass time. Or er, yeah, helps your food and water situation. Um because it serves energy while resting, yeah. What else do I want to build? I want to build that. Okay, cool. Yeah, I have a bedroom now. That thing might give salt. That'd be kind of cool. If it did. I don't know yet. We'll see, I guess. I need food. All right. Yeah, I'm gonna work on getting those things for the scanner room and you. I want you. That'll be handy to have that on uploading to my HUD. Sweet. Still don't know about the the nuclear reactor. I might as well, and then we're we're gonna go to the Aurora. So thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, hope you liked the video. Like and subscribe if you did, and I will see you all in the next video. Peace out.